Hi cheer girls. Why are the 11 of you crying? Leslie Jordan died last Monday from a car accident at the age of 67 years old after his car hit the side of a building at Cahunga Boulevard and Romaine Street in Hollywood. His funeral is going to be watched online. I am not going to watch his stupid funeral online or on TV. Plus, on top of it, I have autism. I need to go and watch Rare and the Last Dragon on TV. We are not watching Rare and the Last Dragon on TV sock puppet Melody Amble. My autism says, you need to watch this funeral with us and be on your best behavior. And you cannot use autism as an excuse like this and my friends and I totally agree with my autism. Fine. I'll do it then. Good girl. Now, let's get our TV set up. My name is Sarah. I am from the Midnight Meeps. Recently, I just got my vocals changed from Susan to the high-quality version of Emma, not the standard version of Emma, because my baby sister Waffles has the standard version voice of Emma, and I decided not to mix it with both standard versions of Emma. And I am here to say my final goodbyes to Leslie Jordan because I will never forget him and his fabulous work from 1985 to 2022. Leslie, I will like to say thank you to the bottom of my heart and for everything. Rest in power Leslie Jordan. You will surely be missed. Thanks Era, Daisy, Deagle, Gideon Waffles Thompson for all of your kind words. Any other members who would like to say their final goodbyes to Leslie Jordan? Yes, we would like to say our big thanks to Leslie Jordan for everything and for the hard work. We are going to miss him very much and I hope his legacy lives on forever. Leslie, thank you very much for all the hard work you put through time. I watched your movies ever since my friends and I were children. I will never forget you for all of the memories that we had. Rest in power. There are no words to describe to you Leslie but thank you for everything. Leslie, I can no longer have words to say but I just want to give special thanks to you and your hard work in theater plays and in movies as well. Leslie, I just want to say thank you for all the hard work you put through and I will never forget about what had happened. I agree with Molly. And I also wanted to say that Molly and I are a big fan of you and your work. Thank you very much and we will miss you. <laughs> Sakura, Yui, Ichika, Maria, Liana and Crystal agree with us. Leslie, we'll miss you forever. Thank you cheer girls and Molly for your kind words. Sock puppet Melody Amble, what are you doing here? Um, I can't explain Emily. I went to the movies and watched Rhea and the Last Dragon. I have had it. I saw you watch Rhea and the Last Dragon without permission from the cheer girls. I will be calling them and Molly Peterson when I tell them about what happened in this situation like this. Damn it. Hello. Is this the cheer girls speaking? Yes. This is us. Why are you mad? Well. I just saw Sock Puppet Melody Amble watching a movie called Rhea and the Last Dragon without letting all of you girls know and then she went on a crime spree to traumatize victims at the movie theater. What? Oh my god. Emily, thank you for bringing this into our attention right now. My autism and I are going to get that bastard when she gets home. And one more thing Melody Amble. I just wanted to say how deeply sorry I am for Leslie Jordan's death and I hope his legacy will have to live on. Thank you Emily. Have a great day. Goodbye. Same to you cheer girls and Melody Amble. Goodbye. Girls, I am completely pissed off. Why are you mad Melody Amble? I just got off the phone from Emily, and she told me that sock puppet Melody Amble went into the movies and saw Rare and the Last Dragon without even letting all of us know and then she actually went on a crime spree and traumatized victims there. She did what? That bastard is going to get it huge time when she comes home. I know your sock puppet is going to get it huge time. And plus, I can't believe she had the audacity to go on our crime spree and watch Rhea and the Last Dragon at the movies. I agree with you Melody. Not to mention that she also sexually assaulted victims. Is she some kind of predator to us like that? Sock puppet Melody Amble. You get your autistic ass down here right now.
my autism and I said that you are in deep trouble. Sock puppet Melody Amble. Melody Amble just got off the phone from Emily, and she said that you went to the movies to watch Raya and the Last Dragon and then went on a crime spree and traumatized victims there. Yeah, what do you have to say for yourself? Girls, I just wanted to say that I'm sorry for ditching Leslie Jordan's funeral and I'm also sorry that I went to watch Raya and the Last Dragon and for going on a crime spree and traumatizing victims at the movies. Apology not granted anymore. Sock puppet Melody Amble, for using autism as an excuse, for ditching Leslie Jordan's funeral, for going to see Raya and the Last Dragon and for going on a crime spree at the movie theater, you are grounded for the rest of your life. Get your autistic sock puppet ass into your room right now. Brianna, Shiana, Yuna and Carla are absolutely going to be so furious when Molly tells them about what you did. So go there, right now, you autistic psychopath. Why? Yay. You girls are so going to regret it huge time. Shut up!